This video will cover the topic, finding symbol interest without a calculator. So, what is interest? I'm not really sure what that means. When you borrow money from a bank, oftentimes you'll have to pay interest. You can think of interest as the price of money. Similarly, when you put money into a bank, you'll earn interest. Interest is the money the bank pays you for keeping your money in their bank. It's useful to be able to calculate how much money you will owe or be paid depending on the amount of money you borrowed or deposited. Let's take a look at an example. Miguel deposits $300 into an account that pays simple interest at a rate of 2% per year. How much interest will he be paid in the first six years? First, we need to identify the initial amount. The problem tells us that Miguel deposits $300, so we know that he has put an initial amount of $300 into the bank. Next, we need to identify the rate at which he will earn interest. The problem tells us that he will be paid simple interest at a rate of 2% per year. So we know that for every year his money is in the bank, he will earn 2% of his initial amount. Now we need to determine the amount of money that will be earned each year. Since Miguel's interest rate is 2% per year and his initial amount deposited was 300, we'll need to calculate what 2% of 300 is. 2% can be rewritten as 0 0.02 or 2 over 100. We can find out what 2% of 300 is by multiplying 300 by 2 over 100. This gives us an answer of 6. Since we've determined that 2% of 300 is 6, and the problem tells us Miguel earns 2% of interest each year, we see that he will earn $6 each year. But we're not done yet. The problem asks us how much interest Miguel will be paid in the first 6 years. We've only calculated how much interest Miguel earns in one year, so we must multiply that value by 6 to determine the amount of money he will be paid in 6 years. $6 per year times 6 years gives us an answer of $36. This answers our question as it tells us how much interest Miguel will be paid in the first 6 years if he deposits $300 into an account that pays a simple interest at a rate of 2% per year. Okay, so when we are asked to calculate simple interest, we must identify the initial amount of money, the interest rate, and the length of time in order to determine the amount of money that will be paid in the end? Exactly. 